Today, we're going to take you on a 12-hour food adventure bus tour. Several Japanese travel agencies have these kind of tours. They usually range from 4,000 to 10,000 yen. Today, we join the HIS travel agency tour all about food. The tour starts at 10 a.m. and the first stop is Tochiki. They are famous for their Sanoda Men, which is known for its lightness and curliness. It feels pretty good to have something light and warm in the stomach in the morning. And after every stop, there's always omiyage to buy. Next stop is one of my favorites. We are going to pick and eat fresh strawberries. There are over 250 different types of strawberries in Japan. And today we are going to eat skyberry strawberries. And they're especially big, juicy, and sweet. We were given half an hour to pick and eat as many strawberries as we'd like. And they also taught us how to pick the strawberries properly using our hands like cat claws. Claw them out slowly so we won't hurt the strawberry plant and also we won't break the strawberries. And you don't even have to wash these strawberries because they're so clean. I gotta say this is one of the best, sweetest, biggest, most beautiful, juiciest strawberries I've ever had. Afterwards, you can also count how many strawberries you had. My friend had about 30. I had about 20. And um, actually, each strawberry costs about 100 yen. So he just had 3,000 yen worth of strawberries. Next to the strawberry farm, you'll find some really sweet animals that you can hang out with a little bit. So this tour is not just about eating. They also take us to beautiful places of nature as well as beautiful animals that we can connect with. And then it's omiyage time. Look at all these beautiful and cute omiyage. Since they're famous for strawberries, of course, expect lots and lots of strawberry creations like strawberry tarts, strawberry pies, cakes, mochi, pudding, macaron, whatever you can think of that can be made with strawberries, they probably have here. Strawberries are very high in vitamin C, by the way, so it's good to eat a lot of strawberries. They have strawberry sheeps as well, and they also gave us some omiyage. They gave us a strawberry shoe creme as well as their famous lemon milk. Next, they took us to a ginger museum with a lot of ginger products and some interesting photo ops followed by some chillaxing in this serene and beautiful place filled with traditional temples where you can take some pictures, breathe in some fresh air, explore. It's only 15 minutes away from our next destination, Utsunomiya. Utsunomiya is a town that is very famous for their gyoza, that's dumpling. This is the subway station, and this is the famous gyoza statue. It looks like a dumpling, but you can see a line across it because while moving, they broke it in half, but they still restored it and now becomes a landmark. When you walk around this town, you're bound to run into a dumpling restaurant because they have at least 30 of them here. So they gave us two 500 yen coupon, a total of 1,000 yen coupon to eat at the restaurants or buy omiyage. So with 500 yen, you can eat a lot. I mean, at least 12 dumplings with rice. You can be completely full with just 500 yen. But if you don't want to eat, that's okay too. You can use all the coupons to buy omiyage because there are plenty of them in this town. And of course, they have dry ice for you to keep the dumplings fresh until you get home. Last stop is the Tobu World Square it is an architectural museum with more than 100 world-famous buildings and 45 World Heritage Sites on a 1 to 25th scale. So we can basically travel around the entire world right here, seeing all the most important buildings in miniature size. The entrance fee is 1500 yen, and it's great to come at night because of all the illumination. Although it is a little chilly because it's zero Celsius right now, but they gave us hand warmers, which was very sweet of them. And they also gave us a free drink. Just look at all these beautiful lights. It's very romantic. 
from Taj Mahal to the Big Ben, Eiffel Tower, Sky Tree, Gaudi's Park, everything is really well made and detailed. And it's great to see from a different perspective because sometimes even when you go there, you won't be able to see it from an aerial view that you can see here. They're also very updated with the current prime ministers and presidents. For example, at the White House, we saw President Trump and First Lady Melania's dolls, which we find very adorable. Overall, we had a fantastic time. The tour costs 9,000 yen, but with all the strawberries, the coupons, the entrance fees, the food and the gifts that we got, plus transportation and staff, it's already like 7,000 yen at least. I don't even know how they can make money off this. So we definitely enjoyed it and we will definitely join more tours in the future.